in the air and on the ground. The massive 100 mile search in the gorge for missing hiker Anna Schmidt continues today with drones, volunteers, and dogs. Welcome everyone to Coin 6 News at 5 30. I'm Chris Holmstrom. The search now at a critical hour as we enter day six since the 21 year old has gone missing. Now we've just learned tonight's search is coming to a close. Still no sign of Anna Schmidt. Eileen Park has the latest happening now. It's the last thing a mother of a missing hiker wants to believe. I don't think she's still alive. I don't think she has survived. But for Michelle Schmidt, this is her painful reality. Honestly, that brings me comfort because I know that she is um, with her Heavenly Father, that she's not hurting, that she's not suffering but we do want to find her body. Her friends and family call the missing 21 year old Annie instead of her legal name Anna. Annie is described as an avid hiker, a musically gifted young woman who recently moved to Oregon from Salt Lake City in July after getting a job here. But on Sunday, she went missing. Any leads? Uh, we, there's nothing significant. We process data all through the day, so at this point we don't have anything that specifically is identifying a particular trail. Lieutenant Chad Guidas said Annie's last cell phone ping showed up near the Tooth Rock trailhead. It's become the staging area for family and volunteer searchers to meet. A man and his son came yesterday with their dog and I, you know, I said, thank you. And he said, I have a daughter. That's all I needed to say. Michelle says she's been overwhelmed by the more than 150 volunteers who came from all over the region to help Saturday alone. We need to remember that we love each other. We care about each other. It's that love that drives John Schmidt, Annie's father, to also lead a search team into the Columbia River Gorge Saturday even though we now enter day six since she was last seen. For this family, they will not rest until they find her. Eileen Park, Coin 6 News.